Hey feds, this next question is all about survivor benefit plan. This person from our workshop said, should I just decline the SBP, the survivor benefit plan, and just invest that money instead? So you have to understand SBP, which most people don't to tell you the truth, but SBP, survivor benefit program plan, whatever, gives your spouse two benefits if you die first. The first is money, right? Gives you money depending on how much you choose of your pen from your pension passes on your pension basically, or at least part of your pension. The second thing is healthcare for your spouse. If you die first, they get to continue their healthcare. So the question is, should I just take that money instead of putting it into the SPP and put it in and invest it? Oh boy. Uh, I'm not saying yes or no on this one. There are so many factors before I can even answer that. For example, does your spouse need money? If you're to pass away, does your spouse need healthcare, FEHB in particular, if you pass away. If you invest it, are you going to invest it in the G fund? That's really not going to make any money. Or are you going to invest it in something that will actually, I mean, how much are you investing? Will it grow enough when your spouse needs it? Now the question, do you know when you're going to die? Cause that would really be helpful in figuring all of this out. <laughs> of course you don't. So wow, there are just so many factors before you can answer that it depends on what your goals are what your health history is like, what your spouse's health history is like, because if your spouse dies first, then the whole plan is ruined. Just so many things to be thinking about. You can't just say yes or no to that one at all. You got to have a plan. You got to be able to put it together and really think it through all the possibilities, what's going to happen more probably than another one. Boy, so many different things there.